You, you have to admit this. When you lose your temper and we're having an argument, then I'll try to say something. You just keep talking. Don't you do that? Yes, I do. Yeah, okay. So. It's a survival instinct. Well, 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 well you, uh, don't hardly have to be afraid of me, so around there. It, so. Well, it's, it's uh, basic why, survival. Well, why and I live in terror to that you're going to do something to us? So, oh, no, you don't. Poor old thing. Polonium. <laughs> yeah. No, but I, I do Why don't have to we say, say our lives? I was going to say our lives revolve around kids with cancer primarily. Right, and, and the, Why don't we have a cure another for cancer? component to this. Why don't we have a cure for cancer? Why don't we have a cure for cancer? Because the, the um, research, the billions of dollars that have been raised, go into finding some gene all the time, and the the, the genome project. Genetics is obviously extremely important. Um, because there's vulnerabilities and there are certain things that are genetic, but by and large, even with cancer, we have found that it's mostly from environmental exposures, a, a huge chunk of it. That triggers uh, something in somebody who's predisposed genetically? Yeah, it can be predisposed oh. or have, has a vulnerability or has a toxic, at this point we're talking now, a toxic overload, a body burden that these children are coming into the world with that is so significant and we're, we have not kept up with that information with the amount of chemicals that they've absorbed in utero and now now, when they're when they're in the world, eating and ingesting from Charles. their food, their water, their soil, their air. Look at Charles. And yet, there's very few studies that are done, and and and, and people okay. don't want it. These big, huge chemical companies, they okay. pay too much money to all these politicians and their huge lobbying groups with the pharmaceutical and the chemical companies that they're not interested in knowing root cause. It's now, no, they're not interested in knowing now. root cause, and they're not it's interested an in and, and, and yeah. really prevention. <laughs> Look at Charles. Prevention is the cure. So and they're not inter is interested in prevention no. because. A lot of these things they couldn't patent the, a lifestyle. They can't patent that. It's a huge problem. And so, therefore, it's not ongoing. taught in uh, med ongoing medical school. These doctors ongoing. don't know it. Oh, look at the Charles. I mean, problem. It won't go I, away, the problem. The problem won't go away. Well, the we problem is, is everybody problem. knows someone who has cancer. Yeah, okay. Everyone knows somebody who has asthma now. Everyone problem. knows a child that has a learning disability because it's epidemic. And obesity, one out of six children. I mean, well, you were getting on when, are, when, is, for when is someone really going to do people, something here Weren't between you? all of these epidemics? And now know. you have the autism. I don't know. Take, take off your top. You know, and thank God <laughs> for, take your, take for organizations like Safe Mind and NAA and Generation your, Rescue that have been saying this for the last, two, last two, 10 to 15 chest. years. Take your top off. Just slip up the bottom part just so we get a quickie. 29 after the hour here on the Amazon Morning Program. I'd like to send this out to your wife and my wife. <laughs> the great Gretchen Wilson. Sing a song, girl. Sometimes we fight about who's wrong and right and stay up on. 